Welcome to my channel, The Fend Craft. This channel is dedicated to showing you designs as well as tips, tricks, and how to make various crafts ranging from hearts, fascinators, hand fan, bouquet, and much more. Today, we're going to be pimping these shoes. Now, this is the outcome of the shoe. That's what we designed. Yes, there's the before and the after. So let's look at the shoe perfectly well to see how it is right now. Yeah, those silver trimmings are a first pimp, but just a slight pimp. Okay, so we take them off first. And I'm going to be making use of a uh, poly material to put sideways on the shoe. So what I did first of all was to put my top bond on the area that I'm going to put the material so i'm placing it to see the part i want to view after i've done that i cut out the excess yes so that's it to cover well so i put more top bond on that side Remember, it's all about creativity. So you can think out of the box and get any material at all that you want to use to pimp your shoes. Just be creative. Be creative. That's the watchword. Okay. Remember, we're working with two shoes. So I would be cutting two pieces. So I place the one I've cut on top of the pulley and I'm cutting the same measurement out for the second leg. So that's still the first one. Now I just remembered, oh, this shoe needs to be used tomorrow morning. So what I'm going to do, I would use Uhu gum so it sticks, it sticks quicker. If not, if it doesn't stick firmly, it means by the time the person starts wearing it, it will start going off. So I have to do this to ensure that the shoe the material sticks firmly to the shoe, so I used Uhu gum. If you are with us for the very first time, we would like to welcome you. I would like to welcome you to my family of the Vent Crafts. So just click that subscribe button so you don't miss our next interesting video. Next, I'll take my razor and cut the SS out close to the heels. No, it's the heels or what you call that. Okay, the sole, yes. So, see where I'm cutting it? Just there. Just before the sole begins. Try and make it as straight as possible. Since it's pulley, it was actually easy because if there was any space, all I needed to do was drag it because of the stretch ability and cover up to make sure that it just meets um directly on top of the sole so i'm going to be cutting all around where i place this material enjoying the video so far and gaining knowledge click the like button click that like that thumbs up thank you Please do remember to check the description below to see the link for our Facebook group. Join in, comment on the appropriate video, send what you have done, and let's see how we have made impact. Next thing I did was to take off that um, silver path there, since only one of the leg has it, and put in my own. I got this from a stone cord. So I put it on both sides because there's a hole there, so it needs to be covered. Then I took tiny stones, all the stones that you use iron to press on top of clothes. So I used them and I decorated the, um, the material part. So that's it being used there.